Hey guys, this is Clinton. Today I'm going to tell you about HTML image tags. How does HTML image tag works? For that you need to create a angle bracket, starting angle bracket and write img inside it. The img indicates for image tag. Image tag is enclosed within a starting angle bracket and a closing angle bracket. This is an image tag which will point to the image which you want to render inside the browser. Any any image can be rendered inside the browser using this image tag. Now we need to know about its attribute. First attribute is known as its source attribute, which indicates the source. What do you mean by source? It is the location where the image is being shared, or you can paste the URL inside this source attribute. This points to the location where the image is being stored inside your computer or you may use the URL to point to the source by using this source the browser can automatically render the image location and display it on the screen of the browser I will show you uh, how it works uh, later on in this video so keep watching this video second attribute of this image tag is alter alt tag what do you mean by alt tag what does it do when the image you have pointed to the source is not valid or is not available in that location or url then it chooses an alternative path which you have given in your image tag and renders it in the browser and displays whatever is inside the alternative tag if this url or source is not located inside the computer path or url then it points to other another location which displays the images which you have pointed to for that you have to create an html boilerplate and i am using atom id because that give me a proper extension i don't have to write much just type html and press enter then i can get the boilerplate and inside the body tag i have to write the img then click inside that uh, you will get the source attribute and alt attribute you can see this is the source attribute where i am going to place the location of the image you can place any you can download any image from the browser and you can store it in your local download browser and you can get the path from there by copying the path and pasting it i am not going to show how does it work how to copy the path because i think you may have uh, done this in the earlier stages and you may have the idea how to copy the path if you don't get how to get the copy the path then you can share that one that thing in my comment section so that i may be able to explain you how to copy the path and paste it in the image source tag after our copying then we need to paste the path in the source tag I have copied the path then I will I can copy the path or directly you can write the name of the image which you have stored in your local disk C D or E anything of your choice in all tag you can write anything of your choice if the source tag doesn't work if the source attribute doesn't work then the alt attribute will work I will show you by displaying it in the browser how does it work if the source attribute does not work then how does alt work and if the alt not work how does the source attribute works now let's save this program and go to my chrome browser here we are going to paste the path which we have created see you can see now the image is being displayed on my browser which i have downloaded earlier and kept in my local disk c and um, it is get, getting rendered in the browser by just using the path and the source attribute isn't it magical thing to do it now we'll see how does all tag works if i delete the path and this path becomes invalid because the images are stored in the image folder then pikachu.png so i have to first specify the path of the image then slash then pikachu.png 
so this is an invalid path now the alt tag will work let's see in the browser how does it work wait a second let me save this and copy the path and we will go to the browser now i'll paste the path here after pasting the path we click enter now see as the source attribute displayed an invalid path so the browser did not render the image in my local disk so it displays the alternative attribute 